All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Far Cry 6. Last time around, if you remember, we had completed the second major area of the game, the Maximas Gorillas. And now we're going to head back here to do some upgrades. I'm going to see if I can upgrade my Supremo, but also I want to see if I can upgrade my regular weapons because remember, we had found a composite bow that now you can modify. And I want to see if I can modify it myself to do better stuff than the, the special bow that I've been using all along. Uh, and then we're going to head to the third major area of the game and see what's there. All right, let's see. Let's take a look at, at the weapons and see what else is available. Because remember, we did level up. I think we hit level 9 now. So we've still got the Explosive Ring, Furioso, the Venom Salvo, and the EM Pulse. Do we have new weapons? We have, ooh, La Sopresa. So it's an explosive round that sticks to surfaces. Projectile sticks to surfaces and explodes when a fuse timer explodes. It's a sticky grenade gun. Yeah, a sticky grenade gun. You know what that would be good for? Vehicles. That would probably be really good for vehicles. You stick them, you run, boom, vehicle explodes, right? Yeah, that sounds good. Um, Maybe. What's this? El Pequeño. Fire standard rounds. Rounds do not, not apply in a scenario effect. What is this? Inspect. El Pequeño. Oh, it's a, a minigun. The massive machine gun could stop a tank or two, but it isn't the most accurate weapon in your loadout. So it's a minigun. It probably goes crazy, right? Making your big entrance and make your targets go boom with a modified single shot explosive sniper rifle. So it's, wow, it's a sniper rifle that shoots sticky grenades. What the fuck? Okay, I might do that. What's this thing? The Zucito. A battery powered EMP cannon that disables enemy vehicles, turrets, and tanks. So this would disable everything. Alright, if we're sneaking around, we can use this to disable the cameras, disable the alarms, maybe? I'm thinking. That's what it seems like. This was the nail gun, right? Yeah, that's kind of... I don't want the nail gun. And I don't want this. Oh, man. I only have enough to get one. Whew, what should I get? What do you guys think? Which, what weapon should I get? I, th I think the most unique out of all of these is probably the sticky grenade sniper rifle. But at the very same time, the EMP, right? Could be really freaking good and just disable shit all around you, right? Nate says that Zucito. Zuci you think Zucito is good? <clears throat> is anyone paying attention? <laughs> Besides Nate? No one else is responding. And here's the Jasper cat. He's over he's arrived to chill with us. Oh god, he's licking my hair. He's looking at my hair. He's grooming me. I, I appreciate that you want to groom me because you, you, you care about me, Jasper. But I, I'm going to shower later today. You don't have to lick my head, okay? I swear I'm going to shower. I know I stink. <laughs> okay. Team Terrorhawk says the sticky sticky grenades. Trevor Phillips says, will there be any event in November for Thanksgiving? Maybe. I'll likely do a stream on Thanksgiving. I'm just not sure what yet. Sticky Rifle? All right, we're doing it. Sticky rifle. It's called the... Is this it? The Sorpresa? Yes. Let's get it. We bought it. La Sorpresa. Cool. La Sorpresa. Now, what I also wanted to see is... Can I upgrade, like I said, that, that bow? Oh, you know what? Don't I have to equip it? I guess I don't have to, but... Here, let's, uh, let's equip it. Here it is. See, it's level 3, so I get the feeling it's going to end up being better than this bow once we put stuff on it. This this bow currently has standard arrows and an optical socket, and that's it. So we could have, like, better arrows and shit, yeah. So let's, let's mess with this bow. Let's see what we can do with it. Okay. So, first of all... Instead of standard arrows, look at all these different arrows. Poison, precision. They fly straighter and a longer distance. EMP disables vehicles and electronic security devices, but then I couldn't kill people with it, right? I don't know. Blast deals blast damage in an area. Can break through bulletproof windshields and impairs weapon damage. Oh, I see. Impairs weapon damage, meaning this will blow up, but it won't do any direct damage if you hit someone with it, you see? 
Yeah, see, all these do, actually. If you take a look, every one of these reduces overall weapon damage. See that? Incendiary is fire. Oh, uh, man. See, I want, I, I want it as a stealth thing. You know, hello, Tyrone. Hello, Guts. How are you? Hello, everyone. Welcome, everyone coming. Rename it to Sticky Destruction Stream, says Team Terrahawk. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> the only one here that I think I really want to do is probably the Precision. They fly straighter and a longer distance. Outside of that, I don't think it's going to make much more. I think we're going to get this. Let's get that. Okay, now. I have a regular optical socket, but now I could do a short range sight, more of a target is visible. Or crosshair sight, because a crosshair sight, more of the target is visible. This is the best one. Let's do it. A better sight. Now, what mods can we put on this thing? Improves move speed while aiming. Improves draw and holster speed. Improves weapon damage to enemies that are standing below you. Improves weapon damage to enemies at low health. Headshot kills reward supremo charge. Chance of healing on dealing damage. Whoa! Chance of healing on dealing damage? Uh, I'm gonna get that. And then I'm gonna get another one. I think I'm gonna do... Improves weapon damage to enemies uh, uh, that are below you. And then there's another one I can do. Mm, this is just pulling it out. This is actually moving when you aim the bow. Alright, let's do that. We've maxed this damn thing now. This thing is crazy. Okay. I have a new skin for it, too, that I could put on. The Backwood Camo skin. And I could put a charm on it. What charm do we want to put on the bow? Uh, Deader Than Disco. A cassette tape. <laughs> a barrel. Life preserver. I don't know what I want to put on this thing. Oh, a gator. Oh, we're putting that the gator. That's cool. The gator. I like that. All right. We, we basically pimped out this bow now. <laughs> Tyrone, I have no idea why everyone's talking about cars. As everyone knows, I don't like cars. I don't, I'm not into car culture. If you guys are going to sit here and talk about cars in the stream chat, I'm not going to participate, which sucks because I like having interactive streams. I'm not going to read that. Just did a super chat and said something absolutely disgusting. I'm not even kidding. His name is I'm not going to read that. And his message was actually in words, something absolutely disgusting. So there you go. Thank you for the super chat. I'm not going to read that. Who said something absolutely disgusting? I appreciate that. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so, that was pretty successful, I would argue. Now, we have a bunch of other weapons I've unlocked, right? This Surf and Turf is so good. I honestly don't think I'm ever going to get rid of it. This is the sniper rifle that I have now, which is actually better than the other sniper rifle. I could probably mod this a bit more. Or... Can I change this out to a different handgun? Yes. I now have a Mark V pistol. A 1911. And I could mod a handgun. Or, look what I just... Oh, shit. The Rococo Loco. The Scorpion or the SMG. I think I'm going to modify the SMG. So let's equip that as my sidearm. And we're going to modify that. Um... <clears throat> what other weapons did I get? I know I got a rocket launcher, but I don't think I want to mess with that. I've unlocked a, sh a couple shotguns. Actually, there's a level 3 crazy shotgun. The computer. What is this? A light machine gun. It's the RPD. And then we have the impact driver special. We have a lot of submachine guns I've unlocked. The MP5. Yeah. And there's a unique one. Oh my god. Look at all the assault rifles I unlocked. The M16. But I have some special ones that are pretty nice, although I'm not really using them. Um, and then these are the Supremos, and this is the new one. Okay, so here's what we'll do. Let's let's see if we can modify the SMG, and let's see if we can modify the carbine. Let's go for those. Um, oops, I wanted to inspect. Standard rounds currently. Oh wait, you can't. What? I can't modify this? Wait a minute. I'm not at the bench. I'm stupid. Now I dumb okay modify your sidearm so 
So right now it's got standard bullets. We could do armor piercing. Oh, I have very low gunpowder. I can't do that much. <sighs> I have very little I can do. Darn. Laser pointer. Improves accuracy greatly. Nah, you know, I'm gonna save up because I only got two gunpowder. What I will do... Can I put anything new on the carbine? Right now we got the eight times scope, right? I can't do this yet. I need industrial circuits. I don't have them. Can't do this yet either. No, I guess we'll stick with what we got then. Yeah. Sniper. Oh my god, look at all these sniper rifle mods. Improves suppressor cooling rate. Improves magazine size. That's pretty good for a sniper rifle. It would only do it up by one though. Alright, forget it. We're good. So I now have a crazy good bow. Okay. And I have a new Supremo that's apparently a sniper rifle that shoots grenades. Impressive. Okay, now... How do I get, am I going to get down here? Exactly. Oh, I can fast travel? Oh, I bought high to... Oh, this is so good. Because I... I At my original base, because I expanded it and I bought <coughs> the hideout locations, I can just fast travel over here now. This is amazing. <clears throat> Let's fast travel right over. Sweet. Andrea says, This is why you do side stuff in the game. You can get a ton of gunpowder and stuff from the FND caches. And, you know, from what I found, I always use them, but you're right, I have a, a ridiculous amount of side stuff. It's done okay now, I feel. What do you mean? This is the land where legends are born, Danny. The 67 revolution started in El Este. El Tigre, La Quimama, Lorenzo, Lobo, they led the guerrillas who overthrew Castillo's father, Gabriel. Libertad is taking out a full circle. And they know I'm coming to give them the good news? El Tigre is very, very excited. Promise. El Tigre. So apparently this guy will uh will help us and join us. Grab all the resources here. All right, let's uh let's select the mission so we know where we're going. There it is. Well, El Tigre? Oh, there it is. El Tigre. That's me. You must be that kid Clara mentioned. <clears throat> Libertad's chosen one. Hello, Cody. Oh, not a kid. Of course not. You're baby Tigre. And don't worry. I'll make sure you don't end up one of Benitez's trophies. Who's Benitez? Head of Castillo's Navy, a real sea monster. She likes to hang traitors like fish for all of El Este to see. Pal carajo. Well, I'm in El Este now. I love it. <coughs> all of it. You, uh, have a long night? <laughs> the rum and coke was flowing last night, baby Tigre. Minus the cock. Been there. I'm sending you some photos. Should help you find us. Is that a crab rock? See. Si. Call me when you get there. And bring grappling gear. You're going to need it. Now get moving up our mountain. We can't wait to meet you, baby Tigre. She's gonna send pictures. He did not send pictures. I'm waiting. He's not sending them. We gotta do this banditos thing. Oh, uh, what's up, everyone? A lot of people just said, what's up? Let's see. So. Uh. Hold on. Max Main, I did not see your first comment. Where, where is it? Let me scroll all the way up. I can't really see it, though. Oh, he says, actually, you can have two bows. You can upgrade one unique bow that you can't. Three total. Personally, I think the other you can upgrade is way better than that one for stealth. Oh, yeah. Darn. Well, too late now. <laughs> uh, how big is the maps to be gaming? It's r very large. What's my dinner today? Um, meatball grinders, chicken meatballs. Um, what's up, Cody? Good, good, hello. Am I almost finished with the game? Asked Tyrone. Uh, we're in the third area. After this area, I think it's probably the fourth part of the story in the finale where you go after, uh, what's his name? The, the dictator. God says, I hope you'll be able to take down Anton Castillo and save Diego. I will do my best. Ghost says, I have a, a, a recommendation for an authentic Cuban meal. It's a one-pot meal, very similar to Italian bolognese. It's called Piccadillo. 
Onions, bell peppers, tomatoes, beef, and spices. Sounds amazing. That sounds really good. Yummy. Okay, so here we go. Distract the guards. Uh, follow the convoy. And create a forest fire. I wanted to make sure it succeeded with all the guaranteed ones. Okay. Let's do... This one will give me a gun. So let's try this one. Okay. It takes two hours, then I can do it. Alright, um, where is the mission? This way. Behind. So I guess I gotta climb this mountain. And probably, once I'm at the top of it, maybe I can, uh, wingsuit down it. Cool. Hello, John Nepper. Everything's going good. Thank you for asking. Hello, Dripster. How are you? Good to see you today. Welcome, everyone, to the nice, chill stream of Far Cry 6. Where we're gonna be using new stuff today. We got a new bow I just upgraded. And we've also got a crazy... Grenade, sticky grenade sniper rifle. I don't know how that's gonna work, but we have it. So we're gonna try it, I guess, and see if we can blow shit up with it. Sounds interesting, right? Ghost of this game makes me crave Cuban food. I've almost never eaten Cuban food. That's something that actually I would like to try someday. I don't think there is much of that kind of food where I live, sadly. Um, there's a lot of good cuisine, just really not a lot of Hispanic-style cuisine out here. Usually it's more Asian uh, than anything else, so... That is something I would like to partake in more in my lifetime. <clears throat> Basilica de la Verhen. Okay. Is Seattle not diverse? It is, but this area of the country where I live, the Pacific Northwest, is a lot of Asian population all these different Asian countries because you know why this is the closest point in the United States to Asia so when when people come from Asian countries this is where they hit first so this is where a lot of them settle down to live so that's why there's so many different kinds of businesses and you know there's a ton of different Asian style supermarkets out here where you can get all kinds of stuff that are Asian products that normally you couldn't buy at a normal supermarket pretty Hi. neat Get voila. There's a flying car, and I should look up how to use it before the end of the playthrough. This big old bean. Yes, no crosses on the East Coast. Mexican and Cuban food is everywhere. There is a lot of Mexican out here, admittedly. But I don't think I've even seen a single Cuban. Seriously, I don't think I've seen one at all. A new treasure hunt revealed. What happened here? I just found it out of nowhere. Maybe we'll do this, since we're here. Locked. Fuck you. Open the door. How do I get in here? How do I... There's gotta be maybe you climb the building or something. Huh. Maybe you can... Sh maybe there's a window. And you can shoot through the window and open the door. There's got to be a way to get this lock open. Ugh. I can see inside, but... How do I get this door open? <coughs> Is it locked by an electric lock? Like, can I <coughs> disable the electricity, perhaps? If I follow these lines, see, disabled no power. How can I power this? There's a bunch of solar panels. Maybe it only works during the daytime. Maybe with the daylight cycle. Maybe that's what it is. There's a bunch of batteries here too. See that? Or I could just keep following these wires. It goes to this house here. How do I get inside this house? This house has a full workbench and everything at it. <clears throat> I didn't want to do that.
There's the yep, look. I gotta find a way to get in here. Uh is there a door? There's a bunch of stuff here. So there's the door, but the door how you get in? How you get into this thing? Looks like there's an oh look, there's something underground. Did you see that? There's a light underground. Yeah, look. You can see it. Oh, look at this. Nice. Okay, that was actually interesting and tricky. I like that. That was pretty cool, huh? Room in reverse, so you need to read the puzzle clue. I do. So now I turn the power on. They're, inter they're interviewing El Presidente. Oh boy. Nothing else here. No, looks like that was it. The door doesn't open, so we gotta go back to where we came. Kicking shit around. Okay. So now we go down here. Now we can flip this switch. Still disabled, no power. Oh wait a minute. It says there's three. What the? There's three different things I need to flip? Yes, look. Okay, so there's gonna be... It's three different puzzles to do. To enable the power here. This has gotta be one. How can I get into this house? noise. Sounds like a snake. I got in here, but I don't know how useful this was. Uh, <laughs> I don't think this is actually how you get into the house. I can't see. It's so dark. <laughs> I'm trying to figure this out. I can't fucking see anything. Uh, Wait. Is that how you get in that window right there, perhaps? Aha! There we go. Okay. So this is a pretty elaborate puzzle. Having to figure out how to get into each house and do this stuff. What's this? Pesos. A box of pesos. Is that it, though? There's nothing... There's no power switch in here? <clears throat> Did I seriously come into this house just to grab a couple of random items? No, here we go. That's two. Okay, two down, one to go. Two down, one to go. There's one more building. That I need to enable the power in. Right here. <clears throat> I wanted to read that, not climb. Carefully written note. The FND is coming for us. We're warned by our children and grand grandchildren. The survivors. This must just be the third one straightforward. Yup. Okay, I think that's enough. That's three switches. So I think that's actually enough that that's going to enable the thing down there now. Oh, look. Grand Premio de Yara. I haven't done any of the races in this game yet. Team Terrorhawks says Paseo, Mojito, and Un Bien look like good human restaurants out there. Unfortunately, no idea of your location. Oh, I live in uh, an outskirt, a, uh, a suburb of Seattle. It's called Renton, Washington. So I have no idea if anything Cuban is near here. I have not seen a, a, any Cuban restaurants in my travels. Doesn't mean that they don't exist. It just means that I haven't really saw one actively. I think we could do this now. Yes. We've done our times in the mud and jungle. If you're reading this, we want to help you. We left you a cache of supplies and a legacy. There's three switches. And I just what did are it. you hiding at home, Senor Party Planner? Here we are. Hopefully something that goes boom. We got some secure bond. And 15 wishes wrist gear. And the Spa's 12 shotgun. I got a new gun. 
and a scrounger helmet. And uh, in terms of foreign investment. And a diary page. I got a lot of shit right here. All right, let's take a look at some of this stuff, right? Um. <clears throat> Improves throwing knife and throwing axe damage. I never use that. I got. I should equip something that I can actually use, huh? <laughs> so that I actually use here. Have I ever smoked a Cuban cigar? I smoked a cigar. I couldn't tell you if it was a Cuban one, though. It was so long ago. Oh, let's see here. So I want to equip something that I'm going to use that's going to help me. Gather ammo and pesos from dead soldiers from much further away. Acquire additional sidearm ammo. When on fire, flames will be automatically put out. Greatly improves general defense while sprinting. Receive pesos from enemies killed by takedowns. Pick pocket. Oh, you know what? I think this is good. This should give us greater defense when I'm on the move. <clears throat> We're just being knocked down by melee attacks. Being poisoned increases your move speed. Automatically gather nearby items while in a vehicle. Hmm. <clears throat> hmm. And I'll just keep what I got for that one. All the pants. Improve repair tool power. Automatically repairs vehicles when inside. Can repair auto turrets. Greatly improve move speed after sliding. Improve poison defense. Improves fire defense. None of these are very good. Improves armor piercing defense. I guess I'll do that. Yeah, none of these are very good, honestly. So I've got reduces movement noise. Carry more proximity gadgets in C4. <clears throat> Slightly improved soft. Nah, that, but the one I have on is the best. And then highlights al ally soldiers and animals at night. This is improves soft target blast and armor piercing defense. It's good. I'm going to keep what I got. Big Papa Pump has tipped me $1.50. He says, Phil, I'm considering getting some prescription gunner glasses. How does the amber tint affect your vision in gaming? Can you see clearly? Do graphics look less realistic? Honestly, once they're on and my eyes auto-adjust a little bit to the yellowish tint, I don't see any difference. I, I actually forget that I have them on. At first, when I first started wearing them, I thought they would, like, affect me. I don't even notice that they're on anymore. Uh, Camel Toe Joe... Tip me a dollar fifty, and he says, "I get views if I do DSP tries at Four Loco." I thought Four Loco was banned. I thought Four Loco became like they, they thought it was dangerous, and they banned it, and you can't buy it anymore. I mean, I don't know. I, I would follow what people said online and stuff, but <clears throat> I wasn't even aware that you could still buy and get the product. Okay, let's continue now to to the gorilla base. I'm saying it's down there. I guess we follow the blue trail here. Okay. Oh, they changed the formula and now you can get Somebody it again. I see. That's you. what happened. Please do not drink Four Loco, says Ghost. Why? What's wrong with Four Loco? Now you've intrigued me. Why can't I drink Four Loco? It's forbidden. You tell me that 39 year old white males are not allowed to drink Four Loco? It's against the rules? Really? It's against the rules? Huh. Alright, I probably shouldn't try to use this the wingsuit here with all these trees. Probably a little dangerous. Tyrone says, do you need upgraded gear to beat the game? I don't think so. I, you know, when the game first came out, I, I skimmed a few reviews. And the reviews essentially said, the new upgrades system is nice, but not necessarily required. Like, you can pretty much beat the game without ever doing any kind of major upgrades. But it's nice if you use it. It's a new system that's interesting if you really want to partake in it, but not required. So. <clears throat> this is their camp, huh? What the fuck is this? <laughs> Hey, El Tigre. I'm at the Crab Rock. Crab Rock. Very artistic. Lorenzo's the artist, and we Garriers are like the crabs. Hard says? Sharp what the fuck is going on here? We from the jungle to give birth in the ocean. We fought from the ocean and gave birth to la revolution. See? Si. Yeah. Got it. Crab Rock. Take the footpath up the mountain. Very easy. A Garria must be short-footed, like a goat. Goat? I thought we were like a crab. <laughs> Hello? Finger. 
All right, take the footpath up the mountain. Here we go. Hey, stay strong out there, okay? A rusted tank. Don't touch that thing. You get tetanus. Oh, hello. I wish you. I really wish you could pet the goats. They're cute. I'm gonna let you pet the goats though. That's a shame. You definitely should be able to. Four loco, the forbidden beverage. I, again, I never had one. I don't even know what it. What is it like? What is four loco like? Is it like soda with liquor in it, or what's what's in it? Is it juice? I don't know what it is. Looks like the waterfall. Oh, oh fucking open. shit! Oh my god, yo, it scared the shit out of me. Oh my god. I think it's a rare animal because it's a special color. It is the Alpha Jaguar. It was a rare animal and it randomly attacked me on the way to a story mission. <laughs> well, thank you for the help. I appreciate you shooting that thing. Holy shit. The Alpha Jaguar out of nowhere scared the shit out of me. Street Fighter sounds fun tonight. I agree, John. I love it. But Valdux says, look, it's Angry Jasper. <laughs> Sometimes I feel like that. Sometimes he gets so hyper that he just goes crazy and it's almost like an uncontrollable beast. Um, El Tigre. I'm at the waterfall picture. He was taken after a bloody battle. Three days of hiding paid off when a platoon of paratroopers landed right in our kill zone. Planning and patience are Garia's best friends. So is a handful of grenades. Yeah, I get it. There we go. So apparently I'm being told for Loco is a deceptively strong mixed drink. Easy, get them from a regular store where they taste no like nothing. Like you can drink too many of them when they're Jesus. drinking. Oh yeah. Ruben Rivera says, when will we do drinking with the king? On the Christmas event. I told you guys the Christmas event is when I drink. The thing is, I don't think my liquor store would have four loco. I don't, like, I don't think they have that shit. <laughs> I don't think I'd be able to get it. I don't know where you even get it from. Looks so peaceful from up here. Okay. Goats. Fucking show-offs. Uh, look at this. Alright. Grapple again, right? Yes. Okay. A lot of climbing. Oh, Tom says the conclusion of this particular story is really lame. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess we'll see. I know what you're going to tell me. You're going to tell me the first story I did was the best one. Because that Maxima story, it wasn't very good. I didn't like the characters. And they were pretty obnoxious people, you know. It's kind of hard to to invest in a plot line when you don't like After the characters. The war, that path became a famous hiking trail for sweaty tourists. They'd visit our camp, leave their shit everywhere, take photographs of people us like we were them. animals in a zoo. So, we might have accidentally with <laughs> <laughs> then I might have to accidentally unblock it. With my new exactly. Uzi. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Fine, a little bit. Is that a turkey over there? I think it is. Oh, it's a pelican. Hello. Feed the pelican. There you go. Give him some food. Oh, what we got? Oh, a fish! Where'd I get that from? <laughs> we fed him a, a, a delicious fish. How nice. There you go, buddy. There you go. He's a good, he's a friendly pelican. How nice. I like that you can feed the animal. Uh, four loco pimp biscuit just give me a dollar fifty and says you can get him in the hood. Me and Gorilla Pimp bought a drink one today for your holiday. I highly recommend you drink one for a good time. Warning, it will make you more gangsta hood rich. Thank you so much for that, that information there. And then TX Shooter 
just did a super chat. Says, Media 4 Local at the service station. Service station? What's that? The gas station, obviously. Okay. I'll make a stop. i buy like 44 locos and drink them. That's all I will drink during the Christmas marathon. It's just four locos constantly. Pound them all day long. See how we see what happens. Sounds like a plan, right? Sounds like a really good idea. Yeah. Nice and safe. Like this path I'm on right now. Totally nothing could go wrong. Pounding four logos all day on a Christmas marathon. <laughs> uh, what's for dinner, B Gaming? Uh, uh, chicken meatball grinder. Yeah. What could possibly go wrong? Oh. Valdez says, is it me or is the volume seem off like it's somewhere in the background of the game? What do you mean? You think that I should up the volume of the, of the game in the stream? I could up it if you want. I, I don't I'm know really what the balance up is. Here. Would make an army blind. You want it louder? Whoa. How is the air both thick and thin at the same okay. time? Thick and thin? Below. The... So that my mic is too low, then I have to lower the game volume. Again, I can't adjust my microphone level at all. I have no ability to adjust my microphone level. My mic is maxed, no matter what. Um, it's always been maxed. It's the I have to adjust the game volume so that you guys can hear my mic better. That's how it's always been. So. <clears throat> okay. For loco. <laughs> Who wants a for loco? These bunnies, these rabbits running okay. around wants a for loco. I'm at the next picture. Let me guess. Guerrillas are like sharks. Deadly predators with knives and Yeah, look, it's a shark. Actually, that rock just looked like a shark. Who's the one dangling underneath it? Nice. That's lucky mama. We never knew when the soldado would find our camp. So we had to secure fast ways up. And even faster ways down. Lucky always volunteered to be the first to test the lines. Brave. I hear you're brave too. Clara told me about you. You know, I also <laughs> grew up without a mama or papa. And you still became a legend. <laughs> Many Garias are orphans, baby Tigre. But it's not our parents who define us, it's our actions. It's like that. <laughs> Alright, so now Battle Duck says, this is, uh, sounds I'm a bit better. Statue. Previously, the game was blasting. It sounded like I was somewhere in the background. Cool. Okay. Jones J says, chat, everyone get behind Phil drinking four logos on stream. It would be amazing. <laughs> Jake has just done a super chat. Thank you, Jake, for the super chat. I appreciate that. Let's get that on the leaderboard. Everyone wants me to get completely shit-faced on four logos, apparently. But if I if I get shit faced on four locos, I have to talk like I have to talk like this and shit faced on four loco. <laughs> yeah, it's required to talk like this on four loco. Back when we stormed Esperanza in '67. Oh wow. Yesterday was the anniversary of his death. a long time ago. That explains the hangover. Every year I drink two bottles of rum, one for me and one for Lobo. You never lived to see a free Yara. To be honest, neither did I. This is the last pick. Felicidades! You're at the top of the world! Now get down here! You're missing <clears throat> all the fun, baby tigre! Ugh, Ghost says, don't do it. It's like Mountain Dew Code Red mixed with vodka, mixed with Kool-Aid. Oh, man. That does not sound too appealing. Patriotas peak. We have arrived. Today. Keep the legends. My father's back in the hospital. The time is said that Evan the inspectors noted missing back. beans. <laughs> missing beans. So sorry. Here's a side mission. El Tigre, I am Ronaldo Alvarez. I write you seeking help from a legend. Shisharon is insatiable. He fights with the will of ten men. And only the blood of soldados can calm him. I fear that the rage fuels his hate to consume all those around him. Man's best enemy? That sounds like a new companion, doesn't it? Didn't they say that Shisha Roan was going to be one of your... Yes. 
Shisharon. Your combat amigo. I totally forgot that we had gotten Boom Boom. I 100% have forgotten about him. Oops. Shisharon. We could get Shisharon and rec recruit the chicken, or I guess it's a rooster, right? I think so. Oh, okay. Um, I need. I want to buy the upgrades for the camp. I don't know where you do it though. I gotta figure out where to go here. <clears throat> don't forget to ask Fredo about the pelican flying up the mountain. It's a treasure hunt. Okay. I fed a pelican to go on the way up the mountain. It's quite friendly. Here we go. El tigre. No. What the hell? No. Trapped. Death is staring you in the face. What do you do? I've been kicked in the cojones a thousand times. I haven't felt them since '72. <laughs> Never do that again. What? Me casa su casa, baby tigre. Come on. Me the family. Lucky, my nose is broke again. <laughs> your fucking mother. Lucky mama. <clears throat> there are people out there who are actually hurt. I am suffering. I easy mama. Herpes doesn't count. Herpes? Herpes Poet of the legends. Well. I sense the hot blood of a fighter. Lorenzo Conseco. And of course you know Lucky Mama, heart of the legends. It's not broken. Really? I felt it go crazy. Another patient? Hmm. Looks like La Morale to me. I'm Danny Rojas from Libertad. The new fist of the revolution. No, Clara's and me. Libertad mm -hmm. needs the legends on our side, heroes to believe in. To fight another Castillo? He's exactly what Yara deserves. Buena suerte. To... Sorry, one revolution was enough. Looks like Clara was wrong. A faith, Danny. They just need to get to know you. Come see me when you get settled. My baby tigre. <laughs> <laughs> Use some characters. <clears throat> Go says Kojima named that character for sure. Lucky Mama. <laughs> it does sound like something he would name a character. Uh, Team Terrorhawks is looking forward to that chicken. It's named it's fried pork what skin, I mean. Shisha Rones? Is that what that means? I don't know. Okay. Clara, I've <clears> met the legends. And there goes Jasper. El Tigre is the only one on board with Libertad. Do whatever you have to and get them to join this fight. The people need heroes to believe in. I just hope they still want to be heroes. I want to do the upgrades, but I'm not sure where to do them in this camp. There's a, uh, looks like, uh, Domino's and the, the side DLC, which we don't have yet. Where do we go to do the expansion stuff? Is it here? No, way. Nah, this is when? your work bench. Like two years ago. Two years? They can't fucking do that. Jasper Kitty, why are you, oh, here it is. Why are you blocking the TV the again? I gotta play, man. Finally. Come on, Jasper. I can't see, buddy. Jasper, come on, you gotta get down. I can't see. Okay. <clears throat> so... Here we go, the Gorilla Garrison. Let's do it. A young person that can help me. We built the Gorilla Garrison. <clears throat> yep. They're going to keep him locked up. Okay. Fuck that. And let's build the you last thing, so we'll have all- Jasper, don't jump up there again! Jasper, come here, on! No? Get down, stop like doing fucking... that. Stop blocking the TV, man. Alright, yes, a fishing hut. Cool. Five star hotel. Achievement. Glamping. Build one of each camp facility. Solo campaign only. Jasper, do not go up there right now. Stop it. Stop blocking that TV, man. I'm trying to play the game. Stop blocking it right now. How dare you? How dare you block the television, huh? How dare you? Okay, I got gloves. Angler's gloves. What can I do? Can you... And can I upgrade these at all? No, not right now. I need more resources. Jasper, come on. Get down course? right now. Stop it. Stop jumping up and down in front of the TV. Stop it right now. Stop it. Stop it or I'll go get the twisty and you go hunt the twisty. Someone You're going to be like this. Okay, what do we do here at the Gorilla Garrison? 
Nothing? You buy crappy weapons. <laughs> oh, boy. Battle Duck says, I shouldn't anger Jasper. I'm going to have to fight him with the bow again. He jumped in front of the TV again. That's it. I'm going to get his twisty. Jasper, I've had enough. I've had enough of your antics. Oh, I'll buy these fishing spots. I've had enough of your antics right now. That's it. Let's do this. Come over here. Holy macaroni. He really wants attention today. You can't see that I'm trying to build up a guerrilla army? Come on, it's very important. You can't be distracting me. Okay, so anyway, we did that. Cool. This still takes two hours, so I can't do anything with this, right? Nope, we're waiting the two hours. Shit. I like your style, Gideon. Okay. Uh, okay, we gotta go back to the mission, which was up here. Go talk to LT Gray and it'll unlock some missions for me. I can now do fishing spots, which is cool. Come here. There he is. No more hugs, I promise. Okay, what does he got for us? Okay. If we want these cranky old guerrillas to help Libertad, we need Lucky and Lorenzo on board. So here's what we're going to do. Ever since yes. Anton got obsessed with the cancer drugs and making Viviro, finding medical supplies for Lucky's clinic has been impossible. So I bribed a pilot to fly some in. When the supplies arrive, we tell Lucky they're a gift from Libertad, and boom! Everybody's friends. Perfect plan, right? So I have to give well, him this watch from a chopper been that has been shot the down. I didn't shoot down my chopper. Go get those supplies before someone else does, baby Tigre. Okay. Remember the three guerrilla pinsmen. Always be moving. Always be on... I'll take a look. Out there, so I really don't have any, any place close... Uh, looks like I'll just have to, to walk over there. Now, there is a treasure hunt here on the map. Maybe I should just grab that quick, because I think we need to get the instruction for it. But it's right next to me, so... Let me head over here and grab it quick. Right here. Yeah, let's do this quick. It's right here. Doop -a -doop -a -doo. I, like the, I really like the graphics of this game. Especially, you know, I'm on the Series X. I don't know if it looks so good on, uh... Everything else, but a roll note. Best view on the island. I'm sorry I can't stay on the mountain with the legends. My duty is to my family. So if they're leaving, I'm leaving too. I pulled together all the supplies from La Moral I could. To find them, all you need to do is feed Danilo and follow where he flies. I told you that Pelican would carry his weight. I hope weight. you made it, <clears throat> Let's see where your Danilo leads me. Here he is. Hello. Oh, it's cute. Hold on. I love these Pelicans. Let me grab all these supplies and we'll feed the Pelican. You ready, buddy? Here you go, have a fish. Coño, your mouth is huge. Gee. A ginormous gully. Nom, 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 nom. Delicious. I bet you love that. Alright, we gotta follow him. Wingsuit time. Follow the pelican. Listen to the music. Follow the pelican. Follow the pelican. You gotta hit the feathers too. Gotta get some loot. The pelican. Oh yeah. Do, 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 do. Follow Danilo. Do, 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 do. <laughs> the pelican, the pelican. Of course, Battle Duck. Of course, it looks better on PC, PC Master Race. Of course. It looks great on the Series X. I, I have no complaints about graphics. Seriously, since I started playing the Series X, everything looks so good. The I'm working on it. Don't put off what you can do today. Because tomorrow can turn Whoa. into yesterday. I think you might need a nap, big guy. Right here. So if I didn't oh, have the wingsuit, I couldn't have done this mission watching. yet. So it's a good thing I got the wingsuit early on. Danilo! Okay. Break that shit. The house, see if there's anything in here. Uh, hmm. Don't forget to ask Sigfredo about the pelican flying up on the mountain. It might mean the lady isn't around anymore. Hopefully, everything's okay. So, 
think these oh. will help. Do I talk to the pelican or? <laughs> Feed him again? Hungry, aren't you? See, si, see. Si. Who's the real guerrilla? You are. He's off again? He's off again. Oh, okay. Gotta follow him. There we go. Pretty cool. Follow the pelican, man. I like it. Look out. I don't want to hit you in your ass because I'm following the pelican. Oh, fuck. What happened? I don't even know what I hit. I don't see anything. Dude, there's nothing here. Oh, this is bullshit. It's fucked up. I'm hitting nothing in the fucking vehicle one. Now, where did he go? He went up the mountain. That was dumb. Hopefully, I can catch him. That was really dumb. Run! I hit absolutely nothing. Like a stump or something. How dumb. Okay, went all the way up here. Oh! Is it the stash? Soto Mayor Farm. Soto Mayor Farm, is this it, Danilo? Or is there more? Well, let me loot this farm first. I don't know if this is where we're going or not. He's, what's cool is he's leading you to other resources. So even if, you know, this might not be the, the end game, but we're grabbing a bunch of stuff along the way. Okay. So maybe that's not it. Maybe we gotta follow him another Careful time. With Let's all see. That One more time. Who's the best pelican in Yara? <laughs> you. All right. You. Yeah, we gotta do it again. Here we go. Wing suit again. Cool. Doop, 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 doop. Damn, this is a pretty a pretty long one, but hopefully it pays off. Hopefully it's a good reward. Doop, 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 doop. Follow the pelican. Doop, doop, doop. This pelican's molting quite a lot. I think he should be checked out by a vet or something. He's losing that many feathers. <laughs> what is going on with this guy? Now I gotta get on a jet ski, don't I? I think I gotta get on a jet ski to follow him. Oh my goodness, this is getting out of control right now. Let's grab some more items. Oh, Guts of the Black Sword says, I know you said you like playing video games on your Series X because of the surround sound, which is great. Is it the only good thing? Oh, what, what is the only good thing that the PS5 can do? Uh, well, first of all, let's be honest here. PS5 has had exclusives this year. Just being honest, most... Mo yes, I'm about to play a couple exclusives on the Series X in Forza Horizon 5 and Halo. But outside of those, there's been no exclusives on the Series X. Definitely, there's been a, a handful of, of good exclusives on the PS5. So that's one advantage. I mean, yeah, there's haptic feedback as well on the PS5, but I don't really get much out of that, you know, I, I feel. <laughs> no, no, no. Follow that bird. Remember the, the, that uh, the movie? Follow that bird, Sesame Street movie? There he goes. Yep, I gotta get on a jet ski now. Boy, this is one hell of a mission, huh? It's pretty fun, actually. I like following the pelican around. It's taking me on a tour of the island. Disturb this guy's fishing. <laughs> Disturb all the fish. Oh no, my pelican's being attacked by seagulls or flamingos or something. This is one heck of a treasure hunt, huh? Treasure out on an island like out here? Probably. It's probably out on a small island. Is he landing? He's landing. Okay. Could this be the treasure? Yes! We finally found it. Well, let's give him a reward for his good work. You just need a key in my pocket, or are you happy to see me? He gave me the key! Okay, a Danny, fishy you key! Are talking to a bird. Ah, he gave me a fishy key! Nice. 
Sergio, if you found this, you found the supplies. Make sure they get into the right hands and check in on Danilo every once in a while. I'll be thinking of you and Danilo, maybe not in that order. Yeah, dear. <laughs> All right. What do we get? An ARC rifle. Interesting. And a, and a Trogon charm. It's a little bird. What the fuck? What the? Oh, boy. Oh, no. Hold on a second. Watch this. You know what we're going to do? Oh, I know exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> Let's use our new weapon. Here it is. La sorpresa. I'm going to give them a surprise. They're never going to forget. La sorpresa. They just did get a surprise. It blew up. Yo, I got him. Oh, God. Oh, it blew up. What the fuck? I can't see the person. All right, I guess enough digging around. I have to just kill them. They're being annoying. They're being very annoying. Oh. Fuck you. I'm trying to pull my new weapon, but I can't see them where I am. Annoying dicks. Now Jasper's jumped in front of the TV again. Yeah, he's pawing the TV. Another treasure hunt? I just did one. I just did one and we unlocked another one. Okay. Anyway. So here we are. Oh my god, it's right there. Jasper. <laughs> Jasper. He's pawing the TV like this on the map. He won't stop. Oh my god. I can't even select the treasure hunt. I guess we'll do this one too since we're here. And then we'll go and do the story mission. Let me. I'm going to steal one of their vehicles. Since I just fucking killed them all. Or I guess I could grab my jet ski. Yeah, I'll grab the jet ski. <laughs> Jasper, come on, get down, buddy. Silly. Fall on the TV like a nut. Okay. The water's beautiful, man. Is there a ladder or some way I can get out of the water? El Tigre. I'm at a little fishing village on the south side of El Este. What is this place's deal? Lurabi. Back in 67, the people of that little place fed all the guerrillas hiding in the mountains. Looks empty now. You can blame Admiral Benitez for that. She shoots holes through fishing boats now. If you ask me, they have the best fish on the island. Looks like this one is named <clears throat> for El Tigre. <clears throat> Too bad no one gave it stripes. The another race. Okay, we got another treasure. We'll see what this one is. If you're reading this, all of us are gone. We knew this was coming. We prepared all we could and left you a cache of supplies to help you avenge us. The secret behind the switches protecting the cache stash is simple. It's hidden with our boats. We named them after the legends, so they should be easy to find. For all our lives, our boats have carried us safely from the sea. Looks uh, like the locals here really are friends. What the? Again, Again with this? Kind of cash they got. Yo, it's going in the house. Now this has a billion cash written all over it. These door <laughs> He's trying to escape through the house. Jaguar meat. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> that was wild. Fucking Jaguar meat. Crumpled note. Seriously, there's so many, there's so many uh, of these Jaguars now trying to kill me. Here's where I need the combination, right? And I don't have it. So I gotta find some boats and find numbers on the boats, apparently. Tigre Del Mar. Oh, okay. Tigre Del Mar. I guess that was one. Ro 
Roja Victoria. And El Lucky. I guess maybe you need to know what order to push the buttons. So Tigre Del Mar, Roja Victoria, and El Lucky. Those are the three I'm looking for. I, say, I, found a sh I saw a shark. I gotta be careful here. So there's... What is it? The Papi Chulo? <laughs> the Papi Chulo. Oh... Sharks in the water. See, si, Papi Chulo. To face good it. Now. Hope you enjoying the stream. I'm glad to hear that. You know, Mastermind says, how you doing, Phil? Anything new in your life? Uh, well, we got new stuff coming up. We got a Halloween event on Sunday. We got a new membership goal in effect for today. Uh, that we're going to count for the month of November to try to get a Christmas event going. There's a few new things going on. I'm having a nice chill stream here with everybody. <clears throat> We're gonna get to the Poppy Chulo. Chef Venus uh, has become a three month supporter. Now that dust is settled, do you think you? Yes, I do think me. I do think me, uh, uh, for, for sure. Absolutely. Thank you very much, Chef Venus. <laughs> yes, absolutely me. Oh, there is the Clarita. Hey. Hola. This is the Clarita. Now, what does it say? What the fuck does that say? Four? Looks like this one's for you, Clara. So that's Clara, and that's four. Right? The number four. Uh. Okay. Any boat over here? Nope. No boat here? Not that I can see. Do <laughs> Battle Duck says, Do you think you? Therefore you do? Yes. I think therefore I do. Huh? No, Stone Carl, I I'm not gonna grow out my beard anytime soon. Maybe eventually I will when I'm older. I don't like a long beard right now. It bothers me. This boat is all decrepit, so I don't think this one's gonna help us. We're looking for intact boats. Is that one? El Tigre. This is one. So El Tigre is one and Clara is four. <clears throat> but we need to find the other two. The other one's out in the water, but there's a freaking shark on it, so I don't wanna fuck with that. <clears throat> Might have to, though. Gasolina. This boat is wrecked, so that's not one of them. Where is the final boat? Because there should be four, I believe. <clears throat> nope, this one's wrecked as well, so that's not it. Guy hanging out. Look at him. What the fuck. Just hanging out, hanging around. Can I sing the Brian McKnight song? Starts back at one. One. It's plain to see. Two. Did you the one for me? And three. Oh, I don't remember. <laughs> no, it's like four. No, I can't remember it. I can't remember it. Oh. La Lucky. Hmm. Lucky is three. Someone knows their military strategies. Okay, so El Tigre is one, Lucky is three, Clara is four, which means that the other one is two. Repeat steps one, two, three. <laughs> I, I I can't remember it. Whenever my work is done, then I'll start back at one. There you go. 
No, I don't remember this. I, if I knew, if I remember the lyrics, I would sing the whole song. So El Tigre is the first one. Tigre. Lucky is three, so that means Victoria has to be two. Okay. And then this one is three. El Lucky is three. And then Clara is four. Wait, that's the Puppy Chulo. Then where's Clara? Clara should be four and Puppy Chulo should be five then. Here's Clara. Wrong. So again, Tigre is one. So maybe Puppy Chulo is two. Lucky is three. Clara is four. And then the Roja Victoria is five. Got it. Should be open now. I don't know what the point of pulling that lever is, but it's open now. Okay, what do we get? What the hell is this? Not a bad haul. Always good to have the people on our side. We got, what do we get? What do we get? Here it is. The Camo Quinceanera. Isn't Quinceanera supposed to be like your 15th birthday party? Quinceanera? I think so. That's all that's in here. Oh, that's kind of lame. That's all that was in there. Oh, I think this reset it. Oh, that's what it is. The reset button. All right. The Quinceanera. All right, so we did a couple treasure hunts. I think now what we'll do... We'll fast travel, and then we will hit the road. And, uh... Let's fast travel, then we'll hit the road, and we'll go to this new, new area. Cool. Alright. 